the brand new Bingo 3000. Can't wait to check it out. Just pop these down. Boop. Hey, what? Boop. Well, that's not right. There we go. Hey! Oh man, this thing's busted. There must be a number on here somewhere. Here we go. Three, 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 four, 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 five, three, three. Typical. <laughs> Technical support. Oh, uh, yeah, hello? Yes, I'm fine, yeah. Look, I just bought a Bingo 3000. I'm having some problem with the bottom kind of legs bit. Yeah, you straighten them out and they just go back up. Yeah, I tried that, doesn't work. Oh, okay, yeah, I'll try that. So grab this bit, yeah, now what? Just jiggle it? Okay, jiggle, jiggle, jiggle. Okay, I've jiggled it. Just try this again. Nah, didn't work, mate. What else you got? Yeah, okay, I'm looking underneath. Just poke around. Okay, can do. Nah, mate, didn't work. Still busted. Now what? Poke the front bit. Okay. Nah, look, mate, I want my money back. What? Mate, I'm not driving all the way back into you guys, all right? I've got finals footy this south. You guys come pick it up. I don't know, send a taxi. What do you mean you're not going to do that? Ah, oh, forget you. That's it. It worked. It worked. Bingo 3000 magazine. Hmm, I thought this thing would be faster. Don't get me started. Can we have a story, Dad? Okay, how about the three little pigs? Yeah! Can you make it funny? Okay, one day there were these three little pigs called Jingo, Gruy, and uh, Jimmy or something. But Jimmy was on a team building course for work, so we won't see him much. <laughs> so the first pig, Jingo, filled her house out of straw. And one day the big bad wolf rocks up and says, Little pig, little pig, let me in. But Jingo says, No way, mate, I'm making nachos. So the wolf's like, oh, I just want to talk to you about your electricity provider. Jingo's like, Oh, that sounds good. And she's about to open the door and then she remembers, Hang on, I've got solar. Jog on, chief. So the big bad wolf huffed and puffed and blew the house in. So Jingo called the police and the police came. And the little pig Jingo is cacking herself and filming it all on her phone and posting it on the gram and getting heaps of new followers. And the wolf's all like, I didn't do nothing. But the cops aren't <laughs> buying that. And they're all like, you got three priors, mate, and that Monaro's stolen, so tell it to the judge, buddy. So they put the wolf in jail. Then the other pig, Gruy, came and helped rebuild Jingo's house. But this time she used Besser blocks. Dad, wait. Up, uh, yep. And they built a rad pool shaped like an ice cream cone and filled it with lemonade. Wow, good idea. <laughs> Meanwhile, the big bad wolf scored a softy judge and was out of jail on good behaviour. But the judge said, you gotta go say sorry to those pigs or you're back in here, buddy. So the wolf went round to Jingo's new joint and Jingo and Gooey said, yeah, mate, it's all cool, just don't try and eat us. And the wolf's like, yeah, fair enough, I'm going vegan anyway, I just eat tofu. <laughs> so they invited him in for a swim to try and make friends, but he kept peeing in the pool. <laughs> So the pigs were like, stop peeing in our pool, mate. It's lemonade and we're trying to drink it. But really, even if it wasn't lemonade, you shouldn't do it anyway. It's full of nitrates and now we're going to have to put heaps of algaecide in. But the big bad wolf kept saying, look, I didn't pee in the pool. And the pigs were like, yeah, you did. And he's like, nah, I don't do that sort of thing. It's against my religion. So the next day, they put this stuff in the pool that makes lemonade turn purple if you pee in it. They didn't tell this to the big bad wolf. And he's there swimming, eating some couscous, talking about the Broncos. But then he goes all quiet and stares into space for a second with this sort of faraway look in his eyes. And the kids are like, here we go. And suddenly the lemonade turns purple all around him. And the pigs are like, ah, see? You're a grub! So the wolf was really embarrassed and he ran out crying. They never saw him again. But apparently he went on to become quite a successful tennis player. So, you know, the system works. The end. Again! No. <laughs> Oh man, I'm starving. I need to eat something. Oh no, Bandit. What? Am I not allowed to eat food if I'm hungry? What kind of a regime is this? <sighs> Carry on. I could go some chicken bucket. Oh, I don't want to get in the car though. Too much traffic. That'll take ages. I'm hungry now. I'm just going to eat one of the kids. <laughs> <laughs> 
know that kids don't agree with you. Ah, she'll be right. I'll have a peppermint tea after. Put a bit of salt on first. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Swallow. Oh, man, that was good. Kids really fill you up. Was that so bad, Mum? I'm just saying, the last time you ate a kid, you were up all night. It's all good. Oh, hang on. Oh, oh man. Something's not sitting right. <laughs> oh, Bingo, I'm not feeling so good. It might have been something I ate. Might have been. Oh, man. Guts a crook. <laughs> 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 Oh, sorry, Bingo. I didn't mean to chunder on you. That's okay. Ugh. Are you finished? Yep. Good. I hope you've learned your lesson. Oh, man. Still a bit hungry. Hmm. <laughs> smells okay. <laughs> One day, there was a lovely big field with grass blowing gently in the when along came an antelope. Doing, 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 doing. But the antelope was chased away by a cheetah. <laughs> then the cheetah got tired and along came some tiny little ants. <laughs> but then came an elephant. <laughs> the elephant left. Phew. And along came a spider. <laughs> Go away, spider. No more creepy animals, thanks. Phew. Oh, wait, it's a snake. <laughs> Frog. Ribbit. 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 Oh, the frog's gone, and along comes a pussy cat. Oh, no. Oh, no, bingo. This cat wants to have a nap. She uses her claws to make a nice fit. <laughs> Yeah! <laughs>